Hi guys, how you doing? This is Rich here on behalf of Rich TV Live, and I got a new secret pick here for you. This is a penny stock. The symbol in Canada is OEE, -E, and the symbol in America is MENXF. The website is memexoee.com. And this is what Memex Inc. is. It's a leader in real-time shop floor to top floor technology solutions. Memex's flagship product, Merlin, delivers overall equipment effectiveness, OEE. -E. That's where the symbol OEE -E came from. Metrics in real time, enabling manufacturers to enhance production and increase income and profits from operations. Merlin has earned the 2013 North America Frost and Sullivan Award for Technology Innovation Leadership. Since 1992, Memex has partnered with 280 dealers worldwide to provide a variety of manufacturing connectivity products and services to over 12,000 customers globally. Now, this is their investors page. You can get more stock information. You can see this is a Canadian company from Burlington, Ontario. And I've just been researching this. About Memex, Memex with its visionary attitude has been on the leading edge of the convergence of the industry trends in computing power, connectivity of machines, industry standards, advanced software technology, and manufacturing domain expertise. This is Internet of Things company, and I love IoT technology. Memex is the developer of Merlin, an award-winning IIoT technology platform that delivers tangible increases in manufacturing productivity in real time. There it is, IoT technology. And you can go to Investor News. Let's click on Investor News. And you can see they just reported their 2020 results. So they just reported the 2020 results. All of a sudden, the stock is starting to trade millions of shares a day. And I'm letting you know this right away that like this is trending up, right? This is a penny stock. Now, remember, Rich TV Live is strictly for education and entertainment purposes. Always do your due diligence. Always do your research before you invest in anything we talk about here in Rich TV Live. Now, you can see that this has gone from 002 to two cents. This is already up a thousand percent since November. It's a penny stock. It's just getting started. This is the American symbol M E N X F. So it's already up 10 X, right? Well, let's look at the Canadian one. We started buying the Canadian one and the U S one yesterday, actually. Um, our club did. I personally haven't yet, but some of our members started to buy this yesterday. You can see it's up 20%, went to three and a half cents and traded 4.5 million shares. So all of a sudden, out of nowhere, after they reported their financials, the stock spiked. So this is a penny stock, but I want to show you guys why I thought there was some interest here. Memex Inc., a leader in industrial Internet of Things, IIoT, manufacturing productivity software, today released its annual financial and operational highlights for its fiscal year ending September 30th, 2020. All results are reported in Canadian dollars, a complete set of audited September 30, 2020 consolidated financial statements. So let's see here. Memex reported revenue of 500000 for the three-month period for a two-cent stock. I guess a three-cent stock in Canada now, compared to 932000 in the same period a year ago, a 46% decrease. But what they're saying is the reason they're having this decrease is not because the company isn't growing. It's because of COVID-19. Bookings for the period totaled 532,000 versus 503,000 in a year ago period, a 6% increase, which means they actually are not slowing down. They're actually growing. This is where I saw some interesting reasons to take notice. Finish the period and year with 1.25 million of project backlog. So they've got 1.25 million of business coming, 63,000 more than September 30th, 2019. And this was very impressive. Their gross margins were 87.8% for the period compared to 69.5% for the year ago period, which means they're going to have higher margins. So maybe on the next report, we may see a huge spike. Cash generating from operations before changes in non-cash items. A 20,000 was a 91,000 improvement from the 71,000 consumed from operations same period a year ago. Income from operations for the period of 3,000 was a 96,000 improvement from the year ago period and a second consecutive quarter of profits from operations. So two quarters in a row, 
of profits from operations. So they were run, operating at a loss. Now they're operating in profits. Net and comprehensive loss for the period of 11,000 is a 126,000 improvement from the 137,000 net and comprehensive loss from the same period a year ago. 267,000 working capital deficit and 549,000 in cash on hand in September 30, 2020, compared to 356,000 in working capital and 740,000 in cash as of September 30, 2019. Company received 181,000 from government of Canada's emergency wage subsidy, as well as 102,000 regional relief and recovery fund loan, which helps stabilize its financial position in wake of COVID-19 pandemic. So let's just take a look at summary financial highlights for the year ended September 30th, 2020. 2.25 million in revenue for the fiscal year versus 3.25 million a year ago, a 31% decrease. Bookings totaled 2.41 million versus 3.48 million a year ago, also a 31% decrease. Gross margin was 76.4 for the year compared to 70.9 a year ago. Cash consumed from operations for fiscal 2020 year before changes in non-cash items was 600,000, 222,000 less than a year ago, and net and comprehensive loss for the year of 749,000. 0.006 per share compared to 1.07 million, 0.008 per share a year ago. Now let's see what management says. Mexmix, Memex has been able to maintain its working capital since the onset of the pandemic, due in part from Canadian COVID-19 relief programs, CEWS and RRRF. Commented Memex CFO Ed Crimble. And in light of COVID-19 and its effects on commerce across North America, we are satisfied with our year and results and are highly motivated to improve on them in 2021. Like most organizations, we had to adjust our business model to accommodate operating in this global pandemic and stay relevant. Our product delivery strategy and a more digitally focused sales and marketing approach have enabled us to stay engaged with our customers and prospects and to think positively about the future, said Memex CEO David McPhail. We continue to see strong interest from new opportunities, as well as a growing number of follow-on opportunities from our established customer base. So this is a company that I thought is interesting. It's a penny stock. I was given this pick from Alberto Ramos. Thank you, Alberto, for bringing me this pick. I am a big fan of Internet of Things Technologies, and I thought, you know, this is a penny stock. It's at three cents. Might be interesting. And who knows where it goes from here? I mean, if it goes to five cents or 10 cents, we get an opportunity to make a multiple on a small, potentially growing company. Now, this is a penny stock. It's very risky. One of the things that caught my attention was the share structure for a three cent stock. 135 million shares was very tight. I thought that that was very interesting. And I think that I like that. And then the other thing that I liked is the market cap. Only a 3.6 million market cap. I think this could easily grow to 10 million market cap, which means we could see a multiple. And as an investor, that's what we're looking for. We're looking for growing market caps and tight floats, tight share structures. This is a relatively good share structure for a company that's only trading at three cents. No news here on OTC markets. If we go to look at the key data on TMX money, once again, you can see a 4 million market cap, just a baby market cap here. So very interesting company. And I think that there's some potential here for some upside. And if there is, we need to be on top of it. We need to be aware of it and we need to be prepared for it. Okay. I'd love to know your opinion on this. OEE -E in Canada, M-E-N-X-F in America. I'm the first one ever to talk about the stock, I'm sure. Once again, we bring you the winners and we bring them to you first. Shout out to Alberto Ramos for bringing me this pick. And our members are now starting to position themselves in case this starts to rocket. If it does, congratulations to all members. I'm not telling you guys to buy this stock. I'm not a shareholder of this stock. Just another pick that we're bringing to you and we're bringing to you first. We'd love to get in early for the win. Love to know what you guys think. Memex, measuring, manufacturing, excellence. Memexoee.com. And the symbol in Canada, 
OEE was up 20% yesterday after we talked about it to our club. And in America, M-E-N-X-F. Thank you guys for watching. This is your boy, Rich from Mr. Live, and I'm out. Peace.